Hello friends, welcome back to Civil Depth BD. Today I will show you how we can model inverted beam in ETAPS. But before modeling any inverted beam, at first we have to check the initial position of beam. How we can check it? We can check it by using the show rendered view command. But this show rendered view command is not directly available in the newer version of ETAPS. You have to create a shortcut key for this show rendered view command. I have already discussed the issue in my previous tutorial. If you missed it, you can check it by using the link provided in the video description box. So for my case, I am using Ctrl F4 as shortcut key for rendered view common. So if I check, I can see all the beams are hanging downward, right? But we need only the inverted beam. So what will I do? I will just select all the beams, necessary beams actually. We do use of inverted beam for architectural beauty. Okay. Now go to assign frame insertion point. By default, ETAPS consider top center 8. Top center 8 for but for our case we have to use bottom center 2. Click on apply. You can see, you can see here by default ETAPS considering all the beams as top center 8. That means cardinal point at top center. Okay. But for our case, we are using 2. That means at bottom center. Now, if I use Control F4 command or key for our case, we can see that all the beams has been moved upward. Okay. Hope you can understand this very clearly. Basically, we use inverted beam for architectural beauty where we don't need to see any hanging beam. So, okay. Hope you liked the tutorial. That's all for today. See you in the next tutorial. Thank you.